This is like a shirt from eighth grade. I'm not feeling confident at all. Eighth grade was like 20 years ago. My hands are getting a little sweaty thinking about it. What do I have the most to lose? Oh, um, I'm studying to be a teacher. Okay. Okay. My favorite part, right? My name. I'm coloring this character's overalls first. Which of the following is an irrational number? I didn't know numbers were irrational. It's not 4.5102. That's a, that's a number. Does anyone know what an irrational number is? I'm gonna go with B. I don't even know what to call the check mark symbol. I'm gonna say that that makes no sense to me, so I hope it's the irrational one. Oh boy, algebra. Solve the system of two equations. Oh Christ on a crutch. Okay, this I kind of remember doing and kind of enjoying. It's like a puzzle. Oh, I like these ones. This one good. Okay, so 2y equals 8, that means y equals 4. I'm gonna go with x being a small number. I, I have no idea what I'm doing. I changed my mind. x is a big number. 15 times 4 is 60 equals 2x minus 4. 64 equals 2x, so x equals 32. Yeah, B. How much time will an old car take to cover a distance of 39 miles at a speed of 13 miles per hour? Why are you driving 13 miles an hour? What is wrong with your car? Express distance as a function of time. So I'm circling B, and I'm getting a little concerned because I think B has been my answer for the last like four or five answers. Time is... Ooh. I'm pretty sure the answer is the speed of light. 39 divided by 13, which is three. 13x equals y. A boat starts from a port and moves 12 miles north, and then moves five miles east. What is the present distance of the boat from the port? This is, there's a triangle involved. Can I call a friend? All right, this is that classic a squared plus b squared equals c squared. I have to find the hypotenuse. Uh, so we're just going to guess on this one. The 12 times 12 is 1. Take the square root of 169. I believe that is 13. What volume of ice cream is contained in a 10 centimeter high ice cream cone? With a base radius of four. I don't remember the volume of a cone, if that's what this is asking me. Okay, so this was like V equals half of B and H or something like that. I think it's time for a B. I'm gonna go with number A. Number A. <laughs> I felt good about it, but C? Study, kids. Stay, stay in school. Don't be like, don't be like Unky Chris. Who is this guy? What's his name? Can we give him a name? 